Okay, this is the ionization chamber I built. It's run by a 9 volt battery. It has two transistors in the Darlington configuration and a 1k ohm resistor and a voltmeter. The actual chamber is just a copper pipe that I got from Home Depot. Um, as you see here, we have current flowing into the pipe. What happens is that current goes into the wire, then it is red. That's actually insanely sensitive, so without anything in the detector, you get a reading of 4 millivolts. But if we introduce some Amerinus CM241, which I got from a smoke detector, lift the wire up, should be quite a difference. We now have a voltage difference of 4.6 volts. One of the reasons why it fluctuates so much is probably the material it's made out of. Typically scotch tape to hold wires into place isn't a good idea. And ionization chambers are generally sensitive to the air around them. This is my ionization chamber. Thanks for watching.